Welcome to MPC Beats. Now in this tutorial, I'm gonna walk you through the process of setting up your controller keyboard with MPC Beats software. So let's dive straight in. First, make sure your pad or keyboard controller is plugged in via USB and then switch on if it has an on and off switch. Then press next on MPC Beats and this will now auto detect our controller keyboard. So now we can see our M Audio Code 49. We can also go to our drop down box under factory and you can now select manually the keyboard controller that you own. Now press next and we now select our workspace which is either simple or advanced. Press next and we can now start making some beats. So let's open up our basic project and this will preload a whole collection of kits and instruments. So now our code 49 is auto mapped to MPC Beats. Let's start off with our pads. Now let's head to our eight encoders. Now these are also pre-mapped, so you can now control key parameters in MPC Beats. So we can adjust our display on our grid, we can go in horizontally, we can adjust our playhead timeline, we can control our volume on our program, then our top row of controllers. This will allow us to turn our quantize on and off. We can adjust our time divisions, we can add our swing percentage and our strength. So these are really useful controls for MPC beats. Then we have our transport control fully mapped. So now let's record a beat. Now we can come out of record and overdub. Then we can head over to our encoders and now we can expand our grid. So this gives us hands-on control of MPC beats. So now let's stop our track and now we can use our encoder to scroll through our playhead. Now if you own the Akai MPK Mini, this is the same procedure. We simply plug in the USB cable into our MPK Mini this is then recognized by MPC Beats instantly. And now we press next. We press our workspace, either advanced or simple, press next, and we're ready to make some beats. Now what we can do from here is load either a demo or a project template. Once that's loaded, we'll have a whole bunch of sounds preloaded into MPC Beats. We can now use our encoders to affect our zooms. We can turn our quantize on and off. We can set our time divisions and our swing amounts. We can control our volumes and we can access all 16 of our pads by jumping through banks A and B. Now, if you own any of our pad controllers, such as the MPDs, this is the same procedure. Simply plug in via USB, MPC Beats will instantly recognize your pad controller, press your workspace, and then press next. And we're now ready to make some beats. Select your project, if it's a demo or a project template, and now MPC Beats is ready for you to start producing. Also on the MPD range, you'll have a number of encoders. This is also pre-mapped directly to MPC Beats, so we can control volumes, we can zoom in and out of our screen, we can control our playhead, our quantize, our swing amounts, and much more. MPC Beats is completely free, so download today and start making beats.